It's 4 p.m. on the last day of June. Bagpipes are playing as 43 new Buffalo Fire recruits who completed 20 weeks of training graduate at West Hurdle Academy in Buffalo and are welcomed into the department by the city's top brass. But by 4 a.m. the next morning, 12 hours later, a Jeep Cherokee SUV, sources say, was driven by one of those new recruits, crashes into a tow truck at South Buffalo Auto Parts in the 600 block of Elk Street. This video of surveillance video from that business obtained by 7 News shows the driver traveling westbound down Elk. The video shows the driver speeding up and then crashing into that parked tow truck. The driver gets out and the video cuts out. Nearly 30 minutes later, it's not an accident. I'll get a car on fire over here. Buffalo police arrive on scene. Adam Cars, is this vehicle near any buildings? It's about 30 feet away from a fence radio and next to uh, construction equipment. Buffalo Fire is also called. Still alarm to investigate a report of an auto fire across the street from number 626 Elk Street between Bradford Street and Dole Street. To go for engine 25, letter 10 and F11. Driver bailed out. No, no direction or anything. I've learned from a source that three Buffalo Fire recruits are currently on administrative leave while the investigation plays out, one of whom is believed to be the driver. The question now, how did the car start on fire? According to a source with knowledge of the investigation, another grainy 30-second surveillance video a while later shows two people getting out of the vehicle. As they walk away, the car starts on fire behind them. Buffalo police say the investigation has been handed over to fire investigators who are handling from here. The Erie County District Attorney's Office tells me our office is investigating a motor vehicle crash and the subsequent fire of the vehicle registered to a recent Buffalo Fire Academy graduate that occurred on July 1st, 2022 at approximately 4 a.m. on Elk Street in the city of Buffalo.